Hello lovelies, welcome to Green Eclectics. I'm Jane and in this video I want to talk a little bit about my art and in specific my most recent painting which I have named Under His Wings. While I show you a time lapse on how I finished the painting, I will talk about two things. Part 1, all the technicalities like size, paint, technique and so on. Part 2, sharing my heart about the meaning behind the motive, what is my inspiration. Part 1, technicalities. First, I started with a background, putting on black mixed with browns. I also felt like adding on some warm metallic tones, gold and bronze. Not all over, mostly concentrated around the edges. Then I used a pencil to lightly sketch up the motive I had in my mind. On this picture you can see what the painting looked like at this stage. I had just started putting on the colours of the skin of the woman. Then I painted her dress. I always create depth and texture by building my colours by multiple layers. For the dress I started with a deep purple and added on several tones of blue from dark to light finishing with the light blue highlights. Then I finally started with the part I was mostly looking forward to paint, the big wings. Again, as you can see, I started with a mixture of white and silver, then I added on more white and in some of the white, it doesn't show very well in the video, I mixed a little bit of silvery glitter. It's very small and almost not visible, but in a certain light and angle, you may see a little twinkly glimmer in the wings. At this point, I left the wings and started to paint the light parts of the background, a light coming in from above the right corner. I wanted a rough, bold expression of the light, so I put on multiple overlapping layers of white, yellow, orange, red and brown. Then I finished the wings with adding the colors from the shining light onto the feathers. Yellow, orange and reds reflecting the warmth of the light. added on some blue in the shadow parts of the wings to create some contrast and also tie in the color from the woman's dress.
last part was painting her hair, which is several tones of brown. Again, building from dark to light colors to get both the low lights and the highlights. In order to emphasize the emotional expression, I toned down the details using a more simplistic and stylized technique, giving center stage to the tender embrace. Part 2. Meaning and Inspiration To me, this is a picture of the very best place to be, exist and live every day, all the time. The inspiration behind this motive I got from a passage of an ancient book of wisdom that's become very dear to me. A little excerpt from these scripts say, He will cover you with his feathers, and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness will be your shield and rampart. I find these words very impactful, a game changer really. If you'd like to check it out for yourself, i leave a link for you in the description box. Anyway, if you don't mind me being a bit personal, sometimes I feel I'm actually in this place. I'm loved unconditionally and being enabled to love back. It's a place of total trust and surrender, admitting weakness and embracing strength. This is the place for receiving comfort, healing and courage to face the next storm. Sometimes though, according to my raw feelings and emotion, it may seem that I somehow has left this place. Life has hit me and I can feel the pain. In these moments, I choose to believe. Believe that in the midst of everything, I'm being pursued by one infinitely greater than myself with big wings, big enough to cover me completely, cover my pain, in my vulnerability, shelter me, bring me to that place of belonging, fill me with true contentment where I'm safe and can rest get rejuvenated, realizing there are yet deeper mysteries to be explored about life's true purpose. There is beauty to be found when I stop striving. Thank you for watching and joining me on my journey of finding a better way of life. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to my channel. Until next time, take care, God bless.